Hey, what's up guys? I am having such a bad hair day today. Let's put on a hat. So I just picked up the closest hat I could find. It's this Mickey hat that I got at Disney World. Anyway, we're gonna get into the vlog today. It's not much of a vlog because I'm not even doing all day. I'm just doing a little bit today. But here's my scooter right here. I know you guys have been missing the scootering vlogs and so have I, but it's too cold to go ride. Luckily, I'm putting in a half pipe in this basement sometime soon. If you check back a couple of vlogs, you click right up here. Then you will see that I have wrapped my scooter, my scooter bars, and my scooter wheels. Both gold. So they are gold. If you look at this scooter, it has gold wheels, gold bars, gold clamp, gold fork. Those were already there. But I made the wheels and bars gold. You guys asked me to wrap my deck. So that's what I'm going to do today. I think that it'll actually be really cool. And it's going to be much easier to wrap it than the bars because these are circular. And it's very hard to stretch it out over a circular surface and get it flat without having like any kind of a rounded squeegee. Here's my deck right here. It's Apex deck. I won it from a Apex 200k giveaway that they had on Instagram. I'm very thankful for winning that because... I would not be able to afford this scooter if I had not won it. Give you a little clip of my scooter right here that you can see. I have the gold bars and pretty much everything is gold except for the deck as of right now. So that's my scooter. Maybe I'll do a scooter check for you guys sometime soon. It's not a full Apex complete, but you can pretty much see that most of the parts on there are Apex. So I'm gonna have to take off my deck and actually clean it today. And that's gonna be probably the hardest part about all this. I'm gonna try and make this one more into a tutorial. Ow! Landed right on my foot, ow! Ow! That hurt so bad. But look, it's still gold. I'm going to try and make this video into more of a tutorial than I did in the last one with my bars. Just because, so that way, if you guys wanted to do this, then you can do it. It's a very cheap way of doing it, and it looks a lot better than just spray painting it. Let's get into this. Step one, wash the part that you are going to wrap. Get your materials. Get whatever kind of wrap that you want. I have gold, because I want gold. You get a hair dryer. I'm not sure where this hair dryer came from. I had a different one last time. Then you have your scooter or whatever kind of scooter part that you're going to be wrapping. For me, it is my deck. And I'm going to say wrapping your deck is definitely going to be a lot easier than wrapping your bars or your fork or anything just because it's large and square. So I'm going to be getting into this. I'm going to measure out pieces of this into fitting on my deck. I'm going to do one piece from all the way here around the deck up to like right there and then I'll do the head tube as a separate piece. So that way it can be like a little bit better and better looking without having to kind of make it all squished up around. So first step, first step after getting your materials is to size, is to measure your deck. I already know my, I already know the measurements of my deck so I don't need to do that. Then you cut out the piece on your wrap. I have a squeegee here and a box cutter. I'm gonna use the box cutter to, to cut this after I measure it out. First of all, I need a ruler or some kind of measuring tape just because it is 20 by 4.5. And you need something to measure that out because you don't know the exact size of it. So step one, measure and cut out your vinyl. So I'm going to be measuring mine 20 long. I'm actually gonna do more than that because it needs to be four and a half right here by that side, by that side, by the other side again. So it's gonna be four and a half by four and a half, plus that, plus that. So it's gonna be all of that added together and that's how much I'm gonna put on. But you don't have to completely wrap this. I probably won't. I probably won't wrap under the grip tape, just about to a little bit, like right at the welds and that's it. All right guys, so I just measured out my deck. It's one inch across right here and four and a half across the bottom and then one inch on the other side. So I'm gonna add maybe an extra half, maybe an extra half an inch to an inch and then I'll be able to get it up to right there. So I just marked off my edges. I did eight and a half right here, eight and a half inches uh, from across there to there just to get the width and then 21 up just so that way I can get a little bit extra without having to have too much. Now I'm gonna cut this piece out and then Lay it on my deck to see if it fits really well. There it is. It's, it's 21 by 8.5. And, and it's going to go on the bottom of the deck. 
and goes all the way around it. I'm gonna take off the grip tape now so that way I can clean off the deck and apply the vinyl. I took my deck off of everything else. Shout out to the company that made this grip tape because it just made my deck look raunchy and so sticky. So, so good job, good job guys. Now, like, I'm not even grabbing it. It's just stuck to my fingers. So, I really wanted to use some Apex cutout grip tape because then I could put like a little gold plate right there. And you can see it from Apex. So I think I'm gonna do that, but it's gonna be really weird with this grip tape. Let's get this vinyl wrapped. Guys, so I didn't film it all right then because I wanted to just like be able to focus on this. So I guess it's not really a how-to anymore or a tutorial. But I've done this much to my deck so far. It's definitely so much easier than wrapping my bars. Uh, there's just a couple of creases because the I forgot to wash the deck and it was dirty underneath. And that's that's the only reason I have all these little bumps. But so far it's looking great and very easy. I basically finished the bottom of my deck. Everything except for the head tube so far. So here it is. All the way up. You see the reflection in there. It goes up to right there. At Right around here, you can see a bunch of folds over and everything, just because, like, that's where everything intersects. That's where the cutout's gonna be in my grip tape, right at, right about there. So that way, when I put this on, you can see it through there, and it's gold, and not black. And that'll look trashy if it was black. I've got it just to right here, because the grip tape's gonna be covering all of this anyway. I'm just gonna wrap the head tube now, maybe do two different parts, this part, and then this part. Uh, just because it'll make it look a little bit... It'll just make it easier. It may not make it look any better, but it'll it'll just make it a lot easier for me. So this is the finished scooter deck that's all gold. The finished scooter deck that's all gold. Uh, I kind of messed up on the head tube a little bit, but you can't really tell on video as much. And you wouldn't be able to tell from like a distance because nobody's going to be looking at my scooter like this. Um, yeah, I got the gold apex cut out. Gold head tube, golden sides, golden bottom. There's my golden bars to go with my golden deck. And then there's my golden wheels and forks and clamp. But yeah, there's that. Alright guys, so this is my gold deck. Thank you so much for watching. I still have some gold vinyl, so you could tell me to do things with that if you want me to do anything with it. Uh, I don't really have any more scooter parts to wrap gold, so that's kind of the end of that. So here's my gold deck. I really like how it came out. Can't wait to ride it. It's probably going to be a really long time because it's so cold outside. But anyways, thank you for watching. If you did enjoy this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. <laughs>